welcome back to my channel this is Laura I'm coming to you today with another Dollar Tree haul I found some interesting things a few new things I hit the jackpot in the crafting aisle you're not gonna believe what we found but we are gonna start with some home decor really cute I found three styles of this I don't even know what I'm gonna call it a geometric type decor this bottom part is like a, a stone concrete type thing with the metal on top and I'm sure these are candle holders gold is not my color but that's not gonna stop me from buying this I'm gonna spray paint the metal white to go with my new decor now I got the circle I got the triangle look at that how cute that is and of course they all come off and then the rectangle look at that these are the cutest. I've never seen anything like that. And they feel they have some weight on them. They're very nice. They're going to be good decor to go like on a bookshelf, on a mantle. I think they're going to look really pretty. So I thought that was a pretty good score for a dollar. Okay, in the cleaning or home section, I saw somebody blogging about these. And this is the Palmolive Essentials Clean. It's 25% more. So you need to make sure and get the one that has the 25% more. And it is the apple pear and they are saying that was on their good I could just barely undo this mmm that smells really really nice I'm very surprised anyway I got me two of these because they are saying they work really good really good they are mentioning that these are really good dish soap products so I'm gonna give it a try and let y'all know what I think and also this is new to my Dollar Tree. I've never seen the Ajax there. They do have the, the Comet brand, I believe, but this one is a 33% more product, and it's the Ajax with bleach. A great, great score for $1, guys. Really great product. I did get me some toothpaste. These are not new to my Dollar Tree. This is the Colgate Sparkling White, 60% more. This is a total of four ounces. So this is a full size product for one dollar, guys. This is a good, a good buy. So always make sure that you look for the extra percentage off or additional percentage on these boxes or on any product at the Dollar Tree. And with that, okay, I also found this product which is new to my store. It's the Rainier toothbrushes and the medium uh, scrub and it is a sure grip handle and it's a teardrop shape it says buy one get one free and the handles are really cool they have like an acrylic layer on them with the rubber the blue the blue or the red so these are new I'm gonna give these a try and let y'all know what I think about these I found some more facial wipes by the Bolero brand these are moisturizing facial wipes renew and revive for the ultimate glow in the lime scent there are 32 wipes to this package and I don't want to open it but I can actually smell the scent it actually smells pretty good okay I also found the chamomile and cucumber hand cream by the same brand this is not the same packaging but the next product I'm going to show you actually is this is new this is the body wash the chamomile cucumber in the bolero brand and you see how the packaging is the same really cute packaging I cannot even believe that this is a dollar and I'm gonna undo this and give it a whiff and it is sealed guys which is a good thing I don't want to open it I can't really smell it through the packaging but I will let y'all know how this works out now with that also I was able to find a loofah to put together look at how cute that looks you put this in a basket nobody's gonna know that you spent three dollars on a little gift and it is actually a nice product you're not gonna believe these bolero brand products are actually very nice so keep your eyes out for these okay, in the spring summer section I did find these little flip-flops look at how cute these are the lemons and I also found the watermelon ones I don't wear shoes in my house I just wear house slippers and if I want to go outside just for a quick moment or whatever, I leave these by the door, in and out, no problem. If they get yucky, they're just a dollar, just chunk them. Here's another thing that I put, I'm going to add to that little bundle. I completely lost it in another bag. 
These are the chamomile cucumber bath salts. And I'm going to show you all how cute it all looks together. If I can pick all this up together. Look at that. Look at how cute that's going to look. Perfect packaging. Nobody's going to know what you spent on this. If you make it look really pretty in a basket, these are so cute. I couldn't get over this packaging. Okay, in the gift wrapping section, I found a few more bags. Spring summery bags. Look at this one with butterflies. Butterflies is all the rage right now. Everybody wants butterflies on anything, crafting anything. Now this front part does have some glitter, but the back part doesn't. Now one thing I have found with the glitter, the Dollar Tree glitter bags, is that you can see it, it'll get all over the place. So what I do to eliminate that is I spray them with some hairspray and the glitter will stick and it won't fall off anymore. So anytime you have glitter products, that's what you can do to help from the glitter falling off and getting everywhere. So this is one, let's check out the side. The side is the same pattern. Another butterfly, really cute. And I did find this one, a bicycle, looks like a birthday bag. And this does have glitter on the front, but the balloons have glitter, but on the back, they don't. And look at how pretty that is with that bike. Now let's check the side. The side is floral, really pretty. So something to add to my stash. I did find in the beauty section, I found this LA Colors eyebrow pencil in uh, dark blonde. I'm going to give this a try. I've never tried this before, but I'm going to give it a try. And I'll let y'all know, I'll report back on this. I finally found some of these storage bin containers that I have seen everybody hauling. I have not found them at my Dollar Tree and they only had two of these. And the other one was some other color that I just didn't like. This is more my speed here for my home. It is a gray color. I'm going to open it so we can take a look. I thought for storage, who doesn't need storage all the time, right? This is the inside. It's kind of like a plasticky type material. I mean, it's not the best. Let me turn this inside out. Okay, there we go. Look at that. I mean, it's not the best quality product, but you know, for something you want to store in the garage, maybe in a lower shelf and keep it contained or under the sink in the linen closet put some rolled up towels in here i think that'll be good i mean for a dollar and the the top does have a wire a real sturdy wire to hold it up and the inside it's like if it's waterproof that's you know it's that type of material so we'll see i mean for a dollar you can't go wrong even good for dog toys if you want to contain your dog toys that would be good only one food item today and it is junk food it is this cheese popcorn the Brim's Snack Foods. It is put out by the Brim Hill Food Company in Bartlett, Tennessee. And this I've had before, it's really good. Great snack for the kids or whatever, really good. I always get some of this stuff. Okay guys, now we're gonna hit up that craft section. I went ham on the craft section this time. I am gonna start with just some little basic stuff. I did find some embroidery thread uh, this is the only colors that they had. They, they had lots of them, but this is the only shades that they have. The yellow, the orange, the blue, uh, pink, and a black. So, you know, pretty good colors to start off with. I always, you know, I make different little crafts and stuff, and I'm always using all kinds of stuff. So, I like to have a variety of threads and yarn and, you know, just different things. So, I thought that was pretty good for a dollar. You don't have to commit to one color. A new item that I found is this Elmer's Disappearing purple spray adhesive look at that guys this is new it is a spray and it is a one fluid ounce and it says that it will stick to cotton paper cardboard photos foam board and wood so we're going to give this a try and see how you know there's so many ad adhesive glues at the dollar tree now uh, but they're not all great so we'll see how this one works out i did find one of these metal signs and it does say home. This I'm gonna put in my stash for an, a wreath during the year. Let's see what we can come up with. Okay, I finally, finally found the cardstock packs that I have seen. Look at that, how many come in there. This thing is fat, fat, fat with product. 
okay and it's got all colors it's got glitter it's got some foam I mean just all colors I'm gonna open this so y'all can take a look I was excited to find this see we have this one orange one it, it's real glittery and then you have this textured type looks like leather but it's not leather it's paper actually pretty nice and look at all this high gloss colors wow look at this yellow and this is thinner paper and then you go into the smaller ones they hide the smaller ones in the front this feels almost like a vinyl and then you have these what look like um, like sticky notes but it's cardstock and then you have this pink that's pretty thick feels like cardstock but it's pretty thick and then you have this in black that also looks like leather it's black with the color of blue it's hard to see but it's got blue and black and then we have some green and then this white cottony type paper really nice too wow I'm excited to dig into these okay we'll put those away and also I did find these crafter square four wood carving set now I know these have been around for a while I had not found them at my Dollar Tree so we're gonna see what we use these for but for a dollar you can't go wrong with them I am gonna finally pull the trigger on a Cricut Air machine uh, pretty soon I think I did find what the Dollar Tree, the Crafter Square is calling a craft picker. And this is the exact tool that they use with the Cricut Air machines to do all your weeding for your design. So I thought I'd better snatch this up because they're not gonna have them for long. And I also found a craft spatula. As you can see, the bottom part is metal and it's very thin so you can slide under your vinyl uh, projects so I was not gonna leave these behind. Okay, and then I did find some great stickers. Look at these metallic rose stickers. Look at how beautiful those are. Aren't these nice? And you get six of them, and they're, they are considered puffy stickers. Really, really nice. I also found these like uh, pop-up family stickers. Look at these, what a great variety. I like to include these on my little treat bags. And then of course for the spring, these pop-up uh, flowers. Look at how pretty the colors on these are. Really cute. The last sticker is a also a pop-up, a seven piece pop-up. It says family, it's for family. Really nice. Okay, and now what I thought was just the big bonus at the Dollar Tree. I could not believe this look what I found vinyl paper now the only bad part was at my Dollar Tree all they had was the yellow and the green uh, but that's okay because I know they're probably going to get some different colors so I said let me start stocking up now for that Cricut machine uh, I could not believe my eyes when I saw this now it is a 12 inch by 48 inches guys that's more than a yard that is a great product for one dollar could not believe it and it does it does say permanent vinyl paper so that's a good one okay now they also had uh, transfer tape for both they've had two different kinds of transfer tape actually three they had the smaller one but this one is the same as this this one comes with the grid lines it has the grid lines I don't know if you can see them there this large one oops had it backwards this large one is 12 inches by 38 inches. So it's just a little bit over a yard. This one is 5.5 inches by 38 inches. Great product. This one does not have the grid lines, but it is also transfer tape. This one is also 12 by 36. What a great product. So this one is actually a little bit shorter than this one. This is actually a yard so you're better off getting the one with the grid lines on it well, a couple of inches more but you know what hey every inch counts <laughs> okay guys i think that was the last item for the day i hope you enjoyed the video i really am enjoying bringing you these dollar tree hauls guys if you want to continue to see more of these let me know in the comments that you're enjoying it and also give us a thumbs up that'll really tell me that you're enjoying the Dollar Tree hauls and it'll also tell YouTube 
to share our channel a little bit more so we can continue to grow. Appreciate you guys for sticking around this haul and I'll see you next time. Bye.